So anyways, we're doing a quick drive back from Chase Bank. Um, just set up another group home. This one's this one's a little bit different. Um, this one's set up for more higher end individuals that are in recovery, if you will. And um, yeah, that's really it. I just wanted to touch base with you guys. Obviously, y'all know that this is what I do. Um, but it's really one of the best businesses that you can have out there. Super high profit margins, very easy to run. If you own the real estate, it's a real double whammy because you can start, if you want to pay down the real estate super fast, you can do that. Uh, if you don't own the real estate, it's a non-issue. You just go to the landlord, find somebody like myself or a landlord around town and just tell them, say, hey, I am interested in partnering with you. There's a million ways you can put it. You can just sign a lease or tell them that you want to partner up with them, however you want to do it. Um, but remember, you're going to have typically six to 10 people living in a house paying you 600, 700, $800 a month. <laughs> it's a cash machine. So like on this one, to kind of go into a little bit more detail, I've got a guy that I'm working with and we'll do an interview with him probably here in the next week or two. And um, so he goes out there, he does the marketing. So we do the marketing for a higher end audience than what we typically go after. So we're going to be talking to a lot of lawyers. We're going to be talking to a lot of um, in, treat, in treatment patient facilities, places like that. And they're sending us clients. So they send us clients. We charge them $700 a month. We actually, in this business, we will not be paying for food. So we'll pay for, we're going to pay rent, which obviously goes to me because my business owns the real estate. We will pay for, um, you know, like Netflix. We're going to pay Time Warner Cable. We're going to pay for the utilities. So this place will have... When it's all said and done, it's a two bedroom duplex. I say two bedroom, it's three bedrooms on each side. It's a duplex. And um, so they'll be uh, on each side, there's gonna be six, six to probably eight beds, depending on how we cut it up. So I don't really even know yet. Because it, when there's enough money in there, it almost doesn't even really matter. Um, so we're gonna have just call it for sake of argument 12 beds on each side at 600 or 700 bucks a bed and I think I'm going to be charging my company about $2,600 in rent and uh, you know 1300 bucks a side basically so assuming that there's call it $8,500 a month coming in $2,600 goes out to the landlord then call it maybe another thousand dollars in miscellaneous expenses insurance, Time Warner Cable, uh, things along those lines. Just do the math. There's a lot of money left over at the end of each month, a lot. And all you have to do is do that two, three, four, five, 10, 20 times, and y'all can do the math. You know, if each group home is making you 3,000 bucks a month and you got 10 of them, nine out of 10 people in the United States can retire on $30,000 a month. Now, if you live in Malibu, probably not. If you live in Pacific Palisades, probably not. If you live in Manhattan, probably not. If you live in certain parts of Miami, probably not. But if you live in Houston or you live in Dallas, um, you can live pretty damn good on 30 grand a month, especially if you're not having to work. You know, you can go down to Cabo when you want to go down to Cabo. Maybe you're not flying private, but you can go wherever you want whenever you want with whomever you want and so that's kind of the idea so um i'm going to sign off for now hopefully you guys you guys like this message and um we'll get a few more of these things up and going for you guys you know uh more of these videos up and going here in the next week or so bye